I do believe in making art and then sending it out into the world. And uh, then I miss it. I, I don't see it for many years. And then something like this happens and it all comes back. It's pleased me very much to see it. And I hope it's pleased other people too. So this exhibition celebrates a moment in New York City 50 years ago when Klaus Oldenburg, as a young artist, began to make these two absolute landmarks of modern art. It didn't have any less grand ambitions than, say, the work of the abstract expressionists before him, but it wanted to connect to people. The work that I did when I first arrived in New York, which was connected with the street, and that grew out of my surroundings as I was living on the Lower East Side. And uh, I was forced to make things out of cardboard and things I would find on the street. The store as well is made out of plaster and, and uh, enamel that you buy in a hardware store. So I was making uh, these works with a, uh, a high intention, but I was making them out of low materials. Given what has happened in the half century since these were made, what younger artists have done since then that absolutely could not have been done if he hadn't had made these first. I think what we have that's a little different is a sense of the seriousness at the same time that it's so playful. There's always uh, new ways to discover form and beauty. When you have found those new ways, people don't at first see it, but they, they get used to it. And, uh, I think that's what's happened to this show. I think uh, people are uh, much more likely now to respond to this show than they were when they first saw it.